Adobe products are great, but they're not the end all be all if you want to do photo manipulations, print design, and video editing. In fact, over the years, I tried several softwares that would achieve the same outcomes as the main design softwares by Adobe, but most of them aren't really good. However, there are definitely some great alternatives, and this is the reason why I'm shooting this video. I want to share with you some of the top alternatives that you can use this year so that you can consider alternatives to Adobe products. Now, a quick disclaimer, I am not sponsored nor I have any affiliate links with these companies. These are just tools that I personally tried and that other designer friends of mine heavily recommended. And by the way, I'm still using Adobe products, so I still really enjoy the brand. And at this time, it's a matter of convenience, simply because I don't want to learn other softwares. But if you're looking for free alternatives or even alternatives where you just have to pay a small initial fee and you have these softwares for a lifetime compared to the monthly subscriptions of Adobe, these are definitely some alternatives that uh, you might want to consider. So now let's jump right into the video. So the first software is called Affinity Designer and it's an alternative to Photoshop. So as you can see, you can uh, literally create uh, all sorts of different uh, editing and even the menus are somewhat similar to what uh, you're used as uh, the interface of Photoshop. And overall, it's going to allow you to create uh, all sorts of different uh, image manipulations and editing. And one of the core benefits is that you can decide to use either vector or raster. So that's definitely really exciting and something that uh, I'm really looking forward to check out uh, also in this uh, new versions. And they also have uh, a lot of different functions which uh, just makes this uh, a really good alternative. And the best part is that uh, you only have to pay a one-time fee. And of course, there is a free trial, so you can test it out uh, quite uh, for a good amount of time before deciding if you want to go for it. So if we go over here and by now, you can see that it's uh, just 37 euros and you have it for a lifetime compared to Photoshop where you have to pay the monthly. So definitely an alternative to consider. Now let's talk about something which is a free tool and that is going to enable you to create all sorts of different designs entirely for free and this is Canva. Now when it first came out I remember trying it and I wasn't really excited about Canva but in the recent years they really made a lot of progress and I'm finding myself using Canva I wouldn't say on a daily basis since my go-to is Figma, but for presentations, I'm always using Canva these days and also for some other collaterals, which uh, are pretty cool. So for example, if you go under presentations, you can see that uh, they have a lot of uh, different templates and this is where Canva really shines. You can uh, essentially go here, select uh, uh, one of these templates uh, and they have a lot of really good looking templates in my opinion. And uh, the moment that uh, you find one which you like, and as you can see there, you also have uh, animations and transitions in between. Uh, you can simply click on customize this template and you're going to be redirected directly in the Canva web app. So as you can see, this makes it really easy to use uh, and uh, just a really cool website to consider whenever you need to create uh, some designs uh, in a fast and free way. Now the very next software is uh, back into the Affinity world and that is Affinity Photo. Now Affinity Photo is uh, going to enable you, as they say over here, uh, has become the first choice for photography and creative professionals around the world who love its speed, power and precision. Born to work hand in hand with the latest powerful computer technology, it's, on, uh, it's uh, the only fully loaded photo editor integrated across macOS, Windows and iOS. So it's uh, just an amazing uh, software to create uh, all sorts of uh, different uh, uh, photo manipulations and uh, or actually photo editing, I would say. And um, just another great uh, tool to consider. Again, they have 30% off in uh, this period of time, but you can try uh, it for free. So always uh, get a free trial, see if you like it and then, you know, consider it if you want to buy it or not. 
Again, I'm not uh, affiliated with any of these. Uh, I'm not. Uh, you're not going to find any affiliate link uh, or um, like. <laughs> I don't really <laughs> care essentially if you buy it or not. Um, it's just uh, a tool which uh, I personally tried uh, um, years ago, and uh, I also have uh, designers, uh, friends of mine, which. Uh, um, have been uh, using this uh, on a day to day and uh, they told me that it's uh, you know <laughs> it's basically their alternative so take uh, all this with a grain of salt now let's uh, continue on with uh, the alternative to InDesign which is Affinity Publisher so as you can see over here um, they allow you to uh, pretty much uh, create uh, all sorts uh, of uh, uh, print design projects and uh, it's a again pretty straightforward <laughs> alternative to InDesign so you can create uh, pretty much any project that uh, you would uh, on uh, Adobe InDesign so definitely something to consider again I'm not going to go through all the details I'm going to leave the website uh, link uh, in uh, this video so that you can go on at your own pace uh, uh, simply because uh, each and every one of these softwares might uh, actually <laughs> be worth doing a video in and of themselves. And uh, the very last one, which is kind of a bonus, and uh, it's uh, DaVinci Resolve. So this is a software which uh, you might want to consider if you're doing a video editing, you don't want to spend uh, money for uh, Premiere. And uh, this one is by Blackmagic Design, which is a really established company and uh, they are a pillar company in the video editing world and uh, the best thing is that you, you can download it for entirely for free and um, there is of course a premium version but i have a friend of mine who's been using it all of the time and uh, they are saying that um, yeah they uh, were just using the free version looks like works like a charm and uh, yeah it's really uh, really stable and solid software. So really hope this was useful and I'll see you in the next video.